everyone. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Today, I am coming on with a new collaboration. It's an open collaboration that is being hosted by Dana from Not Too Shabby Chic and Rena from Lilo Crafts. It is hashtag crash your sash. And the intention is to utilize all the things that we already have in our stash. We have accumulated and um, it's just sitting there, right? To create something with the stuff that we already own. And they are also including the hashtag First Friday, which is the day that we upload every month. So it's the first Friday of every month, and that's today, January 5th. The prompts that they gave us on New Year's Eve was to uh, belly band and cupcake liners. Now you can do two separate projects or you can include them in one project. And that's exactly what I did. I created a belly band and also used cupcake liners. It was a little challenging. So here's the first one that I created. And this is a belly band that's made out of a coffee filter that I dyed with my DIY alcohol uh, sprays. And I sewed along the edges. And here is the cupcake liner. Now for the cupcake liner, all I did was fold it in half and then fold it in half again and glue that to the back. I did sew the bottom. I trimmed it and sewed it because I didn't want too much bulk. But that gave me three pockets to be able to stick little bits of ephemera in. And this is actually going to go into um, a project that I'm working on. And I think this was a great way to include all these little bits in a cute, cute way. I might have put them in the wrong order, but you guys get the idea, right? All these little fun things that can go in a journal and they can use it, whoever is utilizing the journal. And it also serves as a long pocket for a tag now this is not what i'm going to include in there this was just a uh, master board that i did out of a children's book page and i cut it down to size just to demonstrate that when glued down onto your page it'll be glued here here so you have a belly band here and then also a journaling tag there and a bunch of ephemera that can be used in the journal here is the other one that i created same thing with all the little pockets of ephemera in there. I thought this was so cute. Never would have thought of it. I sat there and I just kept folding, folding, and folding until finally I came up with that. And I did sew this one as well on the bottom. And then all my messy threads, I have a basket that I keep all my loose threads in just to add a little color behind it. And then of course the words that I always use. So this was super fun. And this is monthly guys. So great opportunity I mean cupcake liners who doesn't have them I unfortunately couldn't find mine a friend came to the rescue thank you very much um, but to be able to look at your items that you already own and start using them it's a new year I wouldn't claim it a no spend for me but I am definitely being mindful so thank you Dana thank you Rena not too shabby chic and lilo crafts both links will be in my description box this is an open collaboration is done the first friday of every month use the hashtag crash your stash so we can find you as well as hashtag first friday all right i can't wait to see what everyone's created this was good this was a good good start all right and they will be drawing the um, next month's prompt probably on their 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 video on friday today all right my friends till the next one take care now bye-bye